welcome to my show today. I've got another special guest, my cousin Nika, all the way from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. How you doing today, cousin? How are you, cousin? I'm well, thank you. <laughs> I'm doing just fine. I'm just doing fine. Thank you very much. Um, Nika here um, is a cosmopologist. Or, did Cos I say that correctly? I am a or cosmetologist. Yes, I'm a teacher of cosmetology. Even better. Okay. So yes. how long you've been the um how long you've been doing this for? Oh, since 1993. Wow. So, so I, I, I picked the right person to talk to, you know, about this particular topic and subject here. So yeah. um we're gonna be discussing um hair, um, i.e. uh hair that black people have. <laughs> so um okay. I know for I know for a long time, um you know, there's a stigma, you know, you know about our hair type, and a lot of that's changed um, over the years and over the decades. And and mm -hmm. I'm, I'm I'm glad to see that um, a lot more of our women are you know sporting a more you know natural look if that's what they choose to do. I'm not right. going to tell anybody how they should wear their hair, but you know, just the fact that it's more socially acceptable now, um, you know, I think is a you know great thing as to where people don't feel as though they have to, you know perm their hair, do this or do that to get a job and, you know, you know things like that. Um, I actually saw this video uh, probably a couple of years ago, and it was this Asian guy, and I couldn't figure out what they were doing at first, but they went through and they braided his hair up, like, really, really tight, and then they took it out and fluffed it all up and looked like he had an afro. I was like, what? <laughs> so, <laughs> I've um, seen that video. You know. yeah. Yeah, lots of things have changed. So uh, tell us something about your background and, you know, we'll go into what you do and, um, you know, different types of um, hairstyles and hair types and everything else. Okay. Um, well, like I said before, I have been in the industry as a licensed cosmetologist educator um, for almost 30 years. Ooh, that sounds so crazy to say, right? So. Right? <laughs> I, the passion came from watching my Aunt Sharon, our Aunt Sharon, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, your mother's sister. So um, that's where my drive, the passion came from as a, at a very early age of probably about five. I remember playing in my mom's hair. She would let me oil her scalp, brush her hair, put her rollers in. Um, and as she knew that I wanted to go into that field, she started um, exercising my skills. So whatever she would learn when she would go to the hairdresser or uh, Sharon did her hair, colored her hair. She was like, did you watch what they did? Did you see how they did it? Now, can you do my hair like that? So she trusted me at a very early age. Oh, wow. <laughs> yes. And my mom, you know, she had long, beautiful, uh, dark hair. So, and she, she still has long, beautiful hair. Yes, my hair. <laughs> Yeah, so I felt like I was, uh, my sisters had long hair and I had short hair. So I just fell in love with hair at a young age because I was like, everybody here is so beautiful and mine's is just short. Like it just came to my shoulders and theirs was all down our backs and beautiful. And then I watched Aunt Sharon, you know, doing hair um, as a licensed cosmetologist as well, um, had her own business in her home. So that kind of gave me that drive watching um, Aunt Sharon do her thing. And I remember right, okay. the house, they had the um, shampoo bowl that was grandmom. So yep. those things all sparked my interest at a very, very early age. So um, it has been a lucrative career for me for the last um, mm, almost 30 years. So I raised my family as being a hairdresser, you know, two children, um, was married. So, um, yeah, I, it's been a, I, I've always enjoyed it. I, I, they won't let me retire. I said, I want to retire. <laughs> you no, know, they find a way to pull me back into the salon all the time. But um, what was your next question? Sorry. <laughs> you know, one thing, um, you know, about, you know, hairdressers, cosmetologists, as with barbers, it's also the whole social thing as well, um, as to where you get your clientele base and you know you're talking and catching up about family and events and what's going on in the neighborhood and the church or you know whatever it is that you're into. So you know the same thing that applies in barber shops, fellas. You know also you know applies you know um, at the hair salons as well too. Um, 
my um my mother's mother, you know, was a, a hair um you know was a hairdresser as well. And um, then um, her sister, uh, who was called my sister, and I spent uh, time with her in Fort Lauderdale. You know, she was a hairdresser as well. My yes. mom does hair, so um, yes. you know I, I've been around it my entire life. But yeah, um, you know, I get a chance to actually talk to a a, a bona fide true professional who's who's uh, my contemporary age wise, and that you know we grew up together too. So yes, of course. <laughs> so yes, it has been a joy, you know, of course, family functions. I mean, things are not the way they used to be when we used to no, not at all. No. <laughs> get together, sleep over slumber parties, you know, all those things and all the family events, you know, it's crazy because we've gotten away from it. And even if we have, if we still do it, it's not the same. You know, you heard old school music and all the vibes and positivity right. that come along with being in that age but as far as uh and then hair was always part of that culture so always watching somebody getting their hair done it was enough little ones to go around so you always right see that's true one of the the kids the children getting their hair done because i think at that time the girls kind of dominated the boys i think for right. a minute and mm -hmm. so the girls we kind of <laughs> girl power. Girl power, yeah. So Germantown power. girl power. <laughs> yeah, uh, <laughs> because that's what I grew up with. <laughs> right, exactly. So it's, it was all love, though, across the board. It definitely was. But um, I my daughter did my hair yesterday. I wanted to bring her in. She is now. It like, looks amazing. <laughs> Thank you. So it, it took half the night. But yes, my hair is in um, braids. Um. I would have to, just because we're talking about hair, I'm going to let it down a little bit. So okay. she did a technique where is some plaits and then is some free wavy parts, right? So that was just one of the techniques, the many techniques that a lot of new stylists are, are doing um, these days. Um, as far as hair cosmetologists and braiders, they have come up with so many new techniques of doing hair from when I was doing hair and when I was braiding that um, they rocked. Oh my God, they rocked. I remember when my daughter first was using certain products in my hair and I'm like, wait, you didn't you do that before. What's this? Slow down. Right, I'm it's like, wet. wait, what are you doing? And she's like, mom, let me just do your hair. But right. you know, hairdresser against hairdresser, especially mother and daughter against mother and daughter. Oh. It's always that little tug of war conflict. And then I remember my girlfriend who's also a hairstylist was like, her daughter ended up doing hair too. She was like, let her do your hair. Like, I've seen your daughter's work. You know what she could do. Let her do your hair. You would have did the same thing if it was another client that came right. to you. You'd be like, let me do your hair. So I did have to like release that, that control part that wanted to guide her through the process and was like, go ahead. And when she did it, it was beautiful, and she's been doing my hair ever since. Oh. Okay, yeah, I am um, actually because you you forwarded me her Instagram, so I got yeah. a chance to check out some of her work, and I gotta say, impressive, very, 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 very impressive. Yeah. So, um, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, in terms of um, 